Sometimes Dylan seems to be singing about himself and sometimes about Jesus, but the whole is too fluid to need from the listener any analytic effort at separating out the one from the other. The intertwining of the two is, in any case, part of what the song evokes. One theme of Jokerman is surely Dylan's mocking of the distance between his own fallibilities and the omnipotence of his saviour. Yes, and also because um, he's in such a good mood when he's singing it, don't you think? Uh, <laughs> I mean, it's a beautiful vocal. But both the versions that people are sort of most familiar with, the unreleased and the outtake that was somehow available to us more or less immediately. The vocals are so beautiful, the unreleased version even more so than, than the one we get on the album, although I can understand why we got the one we did, because I think the words are better, even better, than on the unreleased. Yeah, it's yeah. a very light vocal, and also there's not all that much music going on, you know? I mean, okay, there's Sly and Robbie, but they're playing very minimalist style stuff there's no big heavy guitar solos or anything in it it's all it's all done as if the song is lightweight and yet the intensity of the verses tells a different story 